Welcome to this month's preview of Volume 1, Issue 9 of Tablet to Table, a monthly e-publication featuring video content that explores culinary archives from around the world. We're coming to you from the beautiful Chesterfield Mayfair Hotel in London, where we're sampling one of the more enduring traditions of Victorian era England, the afternoon tea. Our feature writer, Alison Reynolds, looks at how the concept of afternoon tea developed, as well as some of the misconceptions surrounding this genteel tradition. High tea was a working class, lower class meal that then became taken over and went through all the classes the same way as afternoon tea got taken on by all the classes, but it originated in the upper classes. And Lorraine Mahood returns to provide an example of a Victorian afternoon tea spread that will have your friends ooing and ahhing. As an example, you would never, ever make Darjeeling tea in the teapot where Earl Grey is made. And nor would you make Earl Grey in the teapot where peppermint tea is made because the tea tends to leave a flavour and to taint the pots a little bit. In fact, I think keeping a, a pot specifically for a type of tea is the most sensible thing out. But it's not just about afternoon tea. We also explore Victorian etiquette and dining in general using Mrs Beaton's Book of Household Management as our guide. For more information, visit tablettotable.net. And until next time, from the Conservatory at the Chesterfield Mayfair in London, may good times prevail.